Please subscribe for support us better. Dodge Demon 2018 2018 Dodge Challenger SRT Bamin is fast no matter how you look at it. An HRA rates it at 9.65 ET, elapsed time, on the 1 4th mile and 140 miles per hour these numbers give the Demon bragging rights as the fastest production car, ever. Still, what has this to do with being banned? The truth is, Dodge twisted the words of NHRA to fill the hype train. The car isn't actually banned from drag racing, and here is why. First of all, the quarter-mile strip has seen faster times than 9.65 seconds from non-production cars. Furthermore, it's redundant to mention all funny cars and top fuel dragsters who rip the finish line under 4 seconds at 300 plus mile per hour. What the PR doesn't say is this, if you hit less than 89.99 seconds and more than 140 miles per hour on the drag strip, an HRA automatically requires every car to be equipped with a roll cage and present a racing certificate. That's it. Obviously, the 2018 Dodge Demon doesn't, by default, come with a roll cage, as it would render all way savings useless. However, there's a good chance that, even with the extra weight of a safety cage, you may still be able to beat the 10 second barrier. That is thanks to Dodge Demon's impressive tech stuff beneath the hood and within the cockpit. Let's have a closer look at what gets the 840 horsepower Demon the fastest production car title. The most powerful production V8. Beneath the hood, with a sculpted air screw crests a 6.2 lit. You have a V8 unit. It's the same unit provided on the already powerful Hellcat but with an extra 101 horsepower on pump gas and or 140 horsepower on 100 octane fuel. However, it's not just the fuel that gives the extra push. The 2018 Dodge Demon is fitted with the larger 2.7-liter supercharger running at 14.5 pounds per square inch, 11.6 on the Hellcat. The red line has been pushed upwards to 6,500 revolutions per minute. It only takes 350 milliseconds for the 8-speed automatic to swap to the next gear. While the shift process is anything short of fast, there's still time for the engine to rev while it happens. It's the reason why shifting actually starts at 6,300 revolutions per minute but finishes 200 revolutions per minute later making the most out of the 880 horsepower pouring from the 8 cylinders lead by a race fuel optimized ECU. Yeah. Along with the power figure knocking on the door of 900 horsepower, the engine is also capable of delivering a staggering 770 pounds to foot of torque. The force is transferred by the gearbox to the rear-mounted middle 315-40R18 MT05 drag radials. The liquid in the Demon's liquid 2 air intercooler is chilled by the AC system and enables the intercooler to cool the superchargers and pit charge. The Demon is probably the first production car that will actually go faster when the AC is on. You read that right. The AC is hooked up and accounted for into the actual cooling system allowing the Demon to repeatedly bash the 10 second mark throughout the entire hot summer day. The massive air scoop placed close to the tip of the hood ensures the most flow of fresh, cold air into the engine. It is also helped by the hollow left headlight which increases induction volume by considerable 18%. Epic Burnout Machine There's no respect in the drag world without a proper burnout. 2018 Demon uses the built-in line lock system to burn rubber and get tires really sticky. For an amateur, the burnout sequence looks like something out an astronaut's procedure before liftoff. First of all, you tap the screen to select line lock, then severely push the brake pedal to lock the front bicycle wheels while also holding the button on the steering wheel. Increase pressure on the brake pedal and allow the tabor to heat up the rear middle rubbers until smoke starts to infiltrate in the cockpit although the windows are fully closed. After a whole 10 seconds of rubber shredding, it's time to ease into the staging area. Inside the car, you've just tasted the wrath of the demon, it's only next that you are about to witness its full rage.